What's going on guys, Surgeon's Tech Tips. So in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to use a USB flash drive as RAM. Now, the reason you can do this is so it's, it's so you have RAM sticks in your computer. What RAM does is it allows your computer to multitask with different things because it puts your uh, actions and stuff on your processor and your RAM and sometimes your GPU if you're playing a video game. The only issue is, is I have an SSD in here or a hard drive. Now, it's helpful if you put this in here for extra RAM. It will speed up your system, and I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So what you want to do is you want to put this into the back of your machine. Back here. Uh, I've got to find the correct spot. Make sure the light turns on. Now what you want to do is you want to format this. You don't want to use it yet. You want to make sure there's no files or anything on it that could be important. So you just want to click on it and see what's there. There's nothing there. It's all blank. So what you want to do is you want to click on this PC. Or you're going to go to your file explorer, click on this PC, find the one. Now it's in two partitions for, honestly, I, I don't know why. But if you just click, right click on it, go down to format. You're going to do restore device defaults because that's what you want if it's not there yet. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to name this R-A-M, RAM. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to name it RAM. So you can click OK to share. I'm not responsible for you losing any information. I already warned you that you need to format this to do this. Uh, it, it's going to automatically format it for you, I believe, but you just want to make sure it's already formatted. So I'm going to go ahead and close format now. What you want to do is you want to right-click on the one you're going to use. You're going to go down to Properties. <clears throat> you're going to go to Ready Boost right here. Now you want to do is you want to just wait for it to require the... or. Uh, it's just going to retrieve all the information to see if you could use it. Sorry if my hand's shaky. i got to... Hands are shaky for some reason. So what you want to do is you want to click on use this device and make sure this is all the way up. Don't make it go down. Don't make it go down. If you want to, like, mess with it, you can. But in this case, I'm not going to be using this flash drive. I just want to have extra RAM. So what you want to do is you want to click apply. And then it's done. Now you're just going to click OK. Now you can see that it's been filled up, even though we just formatted it. So what it's going to do is it's going to add this ready boost. So what it's going to do is if you're doing a, say you're typing or something on your computer, you're writing a book, you're writing an essay, you're writing an article for school, what it's going to do is it's going to use that RAM, that flash drive, as extra RAM. So I, I, don't, I don't remember if it shows it in the task manager. Maybe it does. <clears throat> oh, this is the joy of having a hard drive. I would have that SSD in there, but I want to be able to just download whatever on this computer. So there's no running apps. Let's go to more details and go to performance. So as you can see, I have memory right here. So as you can see, it's only, I have four gigabytes of RAM. Only 3.8 gigabytes is being used. That's as much as it can be used. So it's barely in use, but I don't think that does anything though. I highly doubt that does anything. That's more of the processor, like you can see right there. But what I'm just saying is this will help you if you have only a hard drive. This will speed it up a little bit. This is a 16 gigabyte flash drive. I suggest 128 gigabytes, but if you don't want to spend that much money just to use it as RAM, buy an SSD, buy a one terabyte SSD. He'll be completely fine. Uh, and this is an older processor. This is an Intel Pentium. I'm pretty sure... <clears throat> I gotta find out what it is. Give me a second. Uh, it's an Intel Pentium G6300, or, uh, sorry, G630. It's a 2.70 gigahertz, that's what it's clocked at, and it only has 4 gigabytes of RAM. But, as I was saying, USB flash drive, that's flash memory. That's exactly, well, semi what an SSD runs on is flash memory. So this will and should speed up your computer just enough. Oh, it finally updated. It should speed up your computer just enough where that you can use it without having to worry about it slowing down because you ran out of RAM. So if you guys enjoyed this video, like the video if you liked it. Dislike if you thought it sucked. Please let me know what you think of this in the comments below. Uh, if you guys don't know how to do it, I can do a more clarification thing. I can type and show you how to do it. Uh, I can download TeamViewer and help you guys do it, but if you guys don't trust me, that's understandable. But I just want to let you guys know that you could do this. It's probably the easiest thing to do, and it's the most helpful thing to do. See you guys next video, and peace out.